now i feel like that's what i'm going through like i feel like i'm getting jumped by by 12 people and i don't even have the energy to fight back anymore i'm just like bowed up in a bow like to get your leg Monday we're starting off a new vlog so I'm gonna do my hair um, most likely it will be this hair right here I have no idea what hair this is but hopefully it go with what I need to be doing this is the last wig I have to review that is here I have like five more on the way I had stopped hair reviews until I caught up and this is the last of like the 12 that I had to catch up on and so now I can accept them again. Um, so I have to take pictures to post on my birthday. So I got two dresses. I got this black and gold dress. Most likely this will be the one I end up wearing because I feel the most comfortable in it. And I'm just going to put these very big moon shaped hoops on with it. I was trying to find like something, you know, I might go and find something, but it's like long and, um, and you know, whatever, um, long and cocktailish. Because I'm like, the hoops, that's a little, I need some like big bling. Or, or I might wear this one. If I got time, I might take pictures in both. I really, really like this one more. And I'm going to wear these big, 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 big earrings like this with them. The, my only hesitation about this is um, it only has one sleeve and so much of the, the stomach is out. And I won't be able to wear my shaper with it, but... I might could get somebody to sew that in or something and make it work. And then one of the arms is out. And you guys know I don't wear my arms out, especially since I lost so much weight. they just so ugly to me. But anyway, um, these are the two dresses. Believe it or not, both of these were sponsored by Shein. Shout out to Shein for sponsoring my birthday picture dresses. Um, so, yeah, we might I might try to get some pictures in both. We gonna see. We gonna see. I'm trying to see if I'm gonna hire a professional photographer or just let Shug take them. Most likely, I'm gonna just let Shug take them with my professional camera. They gonna go just as hard. And I can always get Shug to take them with a professional camera and then get a professional editor to edit them. So, this is what this video is gonna be about. Let's All go. Alright guys, so I just recorded the unboxing of this wig and I would not be wearing this wig today. Because of the simple fact that uh, it is uh, yeah, 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 a bang wig. I don't want bangs on these pictures. So, plan B. All right, guys. So, since we won't be putting a hair sponsorship at the beginning of this video, because, um, yeah, I don't want a bang wig with these looks. I want, like, a deep swoop or, like, a, a really cute slick back look. Bellway will be sponsoring this video. So, I have to drink Bellway anyway. Every day, y'all know that, and I really needed to prepare for this shoot because, as you guys can see, these dresses ain't playing with your girl. And so, they sent me another super fruit I always say that super fiber fruit. So, thank you so much, Bellway, for sponsoring this video. So, let's get into it. Bellway is a super fiber, and this is the one with fruit added. I love them because they're a prebiotic fiber supplement that helps regulate your digestive system. This one right here is in raspberry lemon. If you guys know me, you guys know I talk about, about Bellway all the time, so it's a win-win situation. They sponsor me, send me uh, products, and the products really do help me with my digestive system. So let's talk about a backstory. You guys know that my stomach was ate up by parasites, and it has been a long over a year road to recovery this is one of the things that has helped me a lot 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 with recovery um it gives you a happy good healthy blood sugar level smooth and moves you okay that's what i'll be needing <laughs> improve heart health less bloating and you just feel better overall so i am going to show you guys how i make my bellway you're supposed to do it every day, but I tell you guys all the time that like me doing it every day is almost too much, too much for me. So I do it every other day. And sometimes I put like an extra half a scoop when I really, really need 
that smooth push okay this is not a laxative this is not like a detox thing or anything like that it's just natural fibers that will help you go so this is a new one that bellway sent over to me but when i make it uh, no ma'am no ma'am i'm not gonna use my new one i have some still left in my old one so let's go i'm gonna use the beauty one today so they do have different varieties for you to choose from um this one just has collagen in it it does the same thing but it has collagen in it which we all know is good for your skin i don't want to open a brand new one so i'm just going to mix this one today um so i can get to moving right, on guys, what i do is just get my cup and i put two round scoops put a little bit more a little, just a little bit because that that one really round okay i put it in there and then i take the sunny y'all know i don't like the sunny but it gotta get used up probably like eight ounces i think this is 16 so you can use like half of this bottle of water I'm gonna use a little bit more than half and you got to stir this really really quick so that it will remain a juice consistency and not turn into like a, a like thick thick I'm gonna put a little bit more so you gotta mix it quick and you have to drink it quick guys so I would really recommend this if you have like um, any kind of digestive stomach heartburn indigestion acid reflux um, stomach ulcers H. pylori, GERD, diverticulitis, anything like that that give that make you have a hard time um, using the restroom daily. I would highly recommend that. And then just to have an overall healthy body in general. Disclaimer, y'all. I end up switching over to the regular super fruit, super fiber, the mixed berry um, because I let it sit too long and it got thick. So let's drink this before it get thick. All right, guys, so. <laughs> so let's drink this on up before it gets too thick. I actually put a little bit too much, but that's okay. And also, if you're on the go a lot, they have like these. You can put in your water and just take it with you. Um, this is a brand new box. I have two boxes. I use the other one. So I really, 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 really like Bellway. You guys know that I talk about them all the time. So I will leave a discount code below. Um, so you can check them out. And you guys always tell me that your insurance company accepts it. So I don't know how that works on the website. But hey, give it a try, y'all. Trust me on this. Trust me, you guys, you know, you know when I told you I got a video coming telling you guys how I got myself better. This is one of the products that helped me. So, yeah, thank you, Bellway, for sponsoring this portion of this video. So, guys, I think I am about to go to work real quick because I can't do nothing to Suggy here anyway because she don't know it. But she's gonna, um, because I can't do nothing to Suggy here anyway. She don't know it, but she about to swoop this hair. Let me just go and drink this for it get thick. Hold up. What I was saying is she don't know it, but she probably have to swoop my hair because I'm going to just like take this and deep swoop it and then put it back in a ponytail, you know, real like elegant like. Um, this wig, I can't wear this too long. Yeah, I just put this in, but the, the, the knots on it just irritates me, so it's time for it to go. Um, so I'm just going to go to work real quick. Yeah, let me just go to work real quick and pack some orders. And by the time I'm done packing orders, she should be out of school. Let me try to find me something to eat real quick, though, so I'm not up there getting weak. Yeah, let's do that. It works, so honey. She Look at this weed. Bro, what's going on? I'm watching Jacqueline. Yeah, so mean. Y'all real, real mean to her. Not y'all, but it's sad. But yeah, let me finish work. All right, guys, so I am done working for today. This is all I'm gonna pack up. I'm gonna clean up a little bit. Now I'm watching Aaliyah. And let's get it on the go. Yo, I'm tired. I'm glad I'm by myself because I look. Girl. Girl. Oh my gosh, let me tighten this wig up. <laughs> Look, honey, if anybody watching, I don't give a f. Y'all know it's a wig because 
No, ma'am. I got a tiny straps up at the back. <laughs> yeah, I am dying. Like, oh my gosh, I'm so glad I looked in this mirror before I went in the post office. Girl. You look a fucking fool. screaming holly i mean i ain't but in my head i am girl i just looked up in a mirror did those straps want to give me a hard time when i'm looking like mr potato head all right there's one girl i cannot believe this wig was slipping like this y'all believe because it was all right now nah, this mug gonna stay on Bro, who been dropping my daddy because this mirror up too far okay all right yeah now we got action honey because baby 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 so that was embarrassing it would have been, but ain't around nobody. And I caught it. Baby, who's standing in line? So y'all know who I heard big motherfucking school like that. Come get these packages. <laughs> there you are. Thank you so much. Is Miss Sherry here? She's gone for the She's day. She's gone. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Y'all can stand in line. Y'all and Jeff can stand in line, but I gotta go. <laughs> VIPB. When they see that we cut to be by Nikki Stickers, they like, ma'am, come to the side, come to the back. Thank you, honey. Now I can go give me some crack filet. All day, every day. Go on soup to do this her. And get this photo shoot popping. Wish I could call one of my friends. Be like, come on, shoot me for my birthday. But it's so last minute. I ain't gonna even do nobody like that. Cause don't do me like that. When it was people, when I did makeup, oh nah, yeah, you could do me like that. Like, if you was one of my favorites, you could. Yeah, Chick-fil-A line just be epically disrespectful. Like, y'all feel good. Oops, shit, I'm on a curve. Y'all feel good, but, uh, uh, yeah. And I'm gonna wait. <laughs> Proof in my video. We made it. Alright, guys, I love this hair. You guys know. No shape for her. Honey, it's hot. Let me turn the air on. Oh, do sis want to go with this one? Oh, I'm gonna be so fine when I put that shapewear on, though. Honey, how am I gonna do this in shapewear, hair, makeup, and this how hot I am? Just from trying them dresses on. It's the next day. I still ain't did no photo shoot. Keep the cameras rolling. I gotta follow up with my GI specialist, and depending on how long this appointment is, um, I might go across the street and get a, a liquid IV for some energy, some hydration. For some hydration. Uh, <laughs> all right, um, so let's go. I'm hopping in the shower real quick, get dressed, head on to that side of town. Cause I don't even know, I've never been to this specialist. I told my doctor like, Mm, yeah, I want to hold you and half last year sick. Find me a GI specialist to make sure my stomach is getting back on track. So I've never even met this person. Um, so let me just make sure I got my insurance card and everything with me. Get dressed and get up out of here because I don't even know if I got some gas. So you got two cars. You hop in the car that got the gas, okay? I be hopping in that truck and they be like, ooh, ain't no gas. Bag it on back. Hop in that car. All right. By the way, I just uploaded... My wig sale, they might all be gone. Um, 
uh, all of the B.O. by the time y'all see the type of say I've been dropping little small birthday sales on my cultural site. And yeah, I'm about to get it, y'all. I'm about to uh, get up out of here. I gotta go. Yeah, by the way, this company, Jesse's Hair, tried not to pay me last night. Why? Because she should curl the hair. We're gonna go with Dossier Virginal Baccarat, which is Ambery Cell from. They said uh, I manipulated the hair and they can't sell it like that because that's not how it look on the website. Because I curled the hair. Everybody saw how it looked coming out the pan. That's okay. All right, your girl didn't do much. I put on one of my dresses, the Danielle dress. This is a beautiful fall plum color from High Quality Fashion Boutique, which will be linked below. Everything I talk about is always linked below. Please look below the video before leaving a comment saying, where you get the dress, where you get the... Then if you don't see it, ask me, okay? I always link it below, and it take me like an hour, two hours to fill out that box for real. So that's why I'm very adamant about that. Um, but anyway, I don't even know where I'm going, so let me get off this phone. I was gonna put some gloss on, but I have to put a mask on. I don't know what to do no more. <laughs> Basically, he wants to do a totally different endoscopy and colonoscopy. He's going to schedule them the same day, though, so I can knock two out in one stone. He said he has no idea why. You know what? He's, he said, you know what? I'm trying not to be angry, but y'all already know how I feel about how they do us. And I really want a lot of us to focus on losing weight. And I, I say that now, but I've been saying it when I was extra fat, too because the, the reason why i'm saying it is because he said that any other patient who couldn't eat would have to switch up their whole diet to survive um if they were like 120 150 pounds they would have been admitted them into the hospital losing the amount of weight i was losing but since i was fat they were praising me for losing weight you get what i'm saying like just think about it i was too 60-ish when I list up started. I switched my whole diet, yada, yada, yada. Now I am 172. That is almost 100 pounds. So what if I just weigh 120, 150? I would have disappeared. Or, or something would have been done by now. You get what I'm saying? So that's why you just keep advocating, advocating, advocating for yourself until you get the right doctors and stuff because some of them really don't care. But Anyway, I'm real hungry, so I got to stop and get something to eat real quick. And then I'm going to try to go get some hydration. I got to get some of my stomach first, though. And then, um, go get shook. All right, y'all. So, I'm, I'm stopping and got me some canes because I didn't eat because I didn't know what they was going to do. I had to full on. I just had to, well, I had to pull over. Let's shut this down. I'm on the phone talking to my best friend and I'm just like my attitude towards life is changing and I, I don't have peace of mind y'all already knew I was struggling with my marriage and all this before all this stuff even happened to my son but um now it's like a hundred times worse and I just I am just really exhausted. So I was telling my best friend that I don't I don't have suicidal thoughts at all, but I have these thoughts like if I wasn't here, so what? So I guess you would I guess that's not suicidal thoughts because I'm not somewhere like I'm gonna take my own life, but I really do stay up to like five four or five o'clock in the morning. Um, with racing and crazy thoughts in my head about stuff and um I'm trying to stay busy but of course you guys need to understand of course 
when you are stressed out and having anxiety and etc over a death over health problems and stuff it kind of makes you PTSD <sighs> and it also leads to other problems so like since my son died I have been having like sharp pain shooting through just random headache pains chest pain, just shooting through and it's just like I don't even be caring to go to the doctor and stuff anymore because what they gonna tell me I'm dehydrated or something like I know I'm grieving but I guess the point I'm trying to make is we this I'll make sense to you guys a little bit later when I'm able to talk a little bit more about my son that but we really need to start looking out for us people like me I'm so selfless I would give the world to people if I could like people I don't even know somebody could pass by me now and be like oh my gosh that dress is so cute and if I could take it off I would give it to them anybody who know me know that and so it bothers me when pe other people aren't like that but I have to realize we not all built the same so The point I'm trying to make is people are going to do what's good for them and they will leave you sick, tired, stressed, depressed, anxious, and won't give a fuck. Some mess around and hap happen to you, they'll be with somebody the next month, next two months, next year. So look out for your stuff. And I'm not talking about my situation in general. Please don't take it as that. I'm speaking in general. Yeah, my marriage is shaky. Y'all been knowing that for the last or however. But I'm not talking about my marriage in this is this this conversation. A life is just life and life is life and y'all. I'm fighting like a mug. Man, I ain't gonna even lie, me and my best friend Stephanie. We used to have so many enemies back in the day. We had been best friends. We've been best friends 33 years now since we was nine years old. I was her first friend when she moved to Texas. In the course of those 37 years, we done had we done fought the mess out of each other. Back, right back best friends the next day, same night. We done fought so many people, got jumped by so many people. She done got jumped when I wasn't around, I done got jumped on. And we I always used to be like, but I came out without a scratch. It was 12 of them, it was 6 of them, and I came out without a scratch. And now, I feel like that's what I'm going through. Like, I feel like I'm getting jumped by by 12 people, and I don't even have the energy to fight back anymore. I'm just, like, bowed up in a ball, like, to get your licks. Like, fuck, get your licks. I get it. I ain't got no fight in me no more. It is getting hard. All right, guys, let's dip in and see if we can get some quick hydration. Just for the heck of it. Let's go. So, we need you just want to rehydrate? Yeah. Okay. I got scar tissue, guys. I got to start alternating arms or putting it in my hand or something. It's really thick, so it's kind of, I can feel like a little, not pain, but. It hurt a little bit more than it usually does. There's some chairs in here though. Let me see how to work this. <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> oh, I'm making like I can't move. Got some little, little lounge chairs. So guys, this is the time I get cold and I didn't bring a blanket because I just dropped in. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and we're done with the matching, what you call this, blood pressure? I don't know. All right, guys, so that was quick and easy. You won't believe how much better your body will feel with just hydration, especially when you suffer from chronic dehydration like me. Like, I be feeling so sluggish and like I can't go on sometimes. And then I walk out of there feeling like a new woman. So today, since I'm not as bad off as I used to be, I did not do, um, I did not 
put all those extra vitamins in there. I just went with the basic hydration, which comes with B complex. I think I said that already. And um, what am I talking about? And yeah, I feel great. So I highly recommend looking up these places in your area. They are IV therapy. This one is called Ivy Bars. They're all over Dallas. I'm at the one in Mansfield, but they are everywhere. Just look it up and look on Groupon first because you can get it way cheaper. This is like between $100 and $180 every time I do this. And you guys know for a minute I was getting them every week, but my copay at the ER is $500. So I'd rather pay $400 a week and come get this dehydration than sit in the ER for hours for them to tell me it's dehydration and just to give me fluid. <laughs> Here's Dindy. What you call them? Beria or Beria? Beria, that's how I say it. That's the juice. That's my dad's. That's my call. They didn't put her juice in here. Somebody didn't check the order. I was outside on the phone and I got case of it. Quesadillas got a couple of packages, a few. Depending on what they are, I'll show y'all. They might be birthday gifts. Very much shin. Very much fun. Oh yeah, I gotta show y'all this. Just a bit of shin, how but I had to get my Bottega green purse <laughs> with the gold chain. All weeks. So um, I working still need to go to the gym, in the bed. <laughs> Watch a Sharika photo shoot finally gonna be in the morning, y'all. Finally, finally. I got a hack to show y'all, but I'm ugly, so that's the view y'all gotta see. Let's go. All right, you guys, see these things right here? I'm gonna have to buy another one because I like for mint to come out of mine. But let's let's talk about this hack. So what we're gonna do here is take the top off and put some water in here. And then this is water, guys. Don't 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 trip. This is water in here. Fill it to the line. So this is a humidifier, a mini one. You guys know I love this. I'm gonna have to get another one because after I do this, yeah, it's not gonna be the same. And I saw an Instagram ad where someone was promoting this, but they were spraying their perfume in here to make the room light up. And I'm like, I went to Amazon to buy it, and I'm like, that's the same freaking thing as a mini humidifier. So we're about to test it. So let's turn this baby on. Oh, wait. No, don't turn it on yet. I ain't like a crackhead sometime. Okay, turn it off. All right, so we're going to put a couple of sprays of Elixir by Kylie because Nicole loved this. I don't know how many sprays to put in here. Well, I just put 10. I got a lot of perfume, so it don't matter. Now let's turn it on and see if it works. See if it's gonna light up the room. Be right back. What'd you say? I smell it from here. It's working. <laughs> it's working, bro. It's, it's working. Really Let's go and get that thing thing and make it purple. Is that blue or purple? Blue. Mm -hmm. That was purple. Mm -hmm. That's, That's purple. purple. Oh my. I know my things. You turned it off? I ain't touched it. Not you. I said it turned it off. Oh, no. It's, it's intermittent. It oh, okay. Ooh. It works. Oh, my gosh. You smell it a lot. Mm hmm Yeah, my mom could be smelling good. Hey, turn that thing off. Nicole said it's too strong. But on a commercial, it did say two sprays of perfume, and my ass put 10. All right, y'all. Makeup done. So this one a little dramatic this morning. I ain't wore eyeshadow in so long. Let's do my hair. Just a little bun with a little swoop. Okay. Wish the swoop could have swooped a little bit more, but the hair ain't that thick enough up here. Tuesday, but you get paid to clean it. It's a car food. Let me see. Cause I ain't nothing on that card. Oh, it might be vlogging clips. Oh yeah, girl. <laughs> What's a good pose to do? Mm -hmm. What's a good pose? It's a wrap. Thanks for 
Thanks to my bestie for letting me use her club. It's a cigar lounge club, everything. Uh, yeah. Yep. Thanks to Big Shook. Oh. <laughs> uh, I'm going to let my bestie show y'all her club in case you want to book a party or something here. Y'all seen this place a lot of times in my classes and stuff. But yeah, let's go. Okay, there. Flip the screen. You want to look at yourself? Yeah, you camera. So you look crazy. Okay. Is it start? Yeah. The red dot up. Mm -hmm. Hey, hey, what's up? It's your girl Steph Lover. Shout out to Platinum D, aka the Goat. When they see this, it'll be my birthday. Happy birthday! <laughs> oh, you know what? Let's. Start. Are you gonna edit it? You can just pull it over, I edited it. Okay. What up, what up? It's your girl, Steph Lover, checking in. Where the camera at, girl? I look like I'm looking at the sky. Right here. Oh, just looking at the lens right here. Okay. Hey, hey, what's up? It's your girl, Steph Lover, checking in. And I just want to say a very special happy birthday to my bestie. Woo! Pookie! What up? Platinum D in the building. I appreciate all the love and support, Pook. I thank you, and I just wish you many, many more. This year has been a year to remember, but God is in control. You are a queen, and I love you. Sissy! Happy birthday, boo. What up? So I'm going to, I'm going to try to attempt to record and show y'all a little bit of where we are. Well, you want to show something? You can flip the yeah, camera. Yeah, let's flip the camera, baby, because me walking back was probably not a good idea. Thank you, Nisa. Help me, child. <laughs> all right, all right. So I just want to kind of show y'all a little bit. If you have never been to Allure, we are at 110 South Cocker Hill um, at the corner of, what is this? Um, Cocker Hill and Beltline. Lord have mercy. All right, so we're here. We're here. Full humidor. Full, full humidor. I'll just go in a little bit and let y'all see a little bit of what we have. So we have your sweet lines, we have your black on beat the back oh, okay, da da da. Black on lines. Um, we have some of everything. Placentias, we have your Perdomos. We have a lot of sticks. If you like to smoke, we have a full humidor and we are distributors as well. So we sell by the boxes. This is our entertainment complex. Shout out to all the bands that come through and do their thing. We are decorated for Halloween. Yes, we love festivities. We have a full bar, full kitchen. That's right, and lots of hookahs. But my main and favorite place to be is out here, y'all. It goes down from fight parties to uh, birthday parties, you can rent this out. We're here every every day. So you can come by during the daytime and have a nice libation as well as be on your laptop and just kind of hang out on the patio. This is one of our best amenities. All right, so thank y'all so much. Thank y'all so much for giving me your time. I appreciate you. Steph Lubba, Allure Jazz and Cigar Lounge. Peace. All right, guys. So I just thought I would include a couple of photos. Don't forget to go over to my Instagram. I will link my link tree below, which will take you to every single one of my social media outlets. All right. Um, I just wanted to show you guys the photos because I thought they came out absolutely great. I think the smoky cigar room with the grown and sexy 41 as in one w-o-n because it has been one heck of a year so i feel like a winner um so yeah i will drop the link i'm gonna have a birthday sale on my shapewear i am wearing the platinum plus based on these photos and i am gonna shamelessly drop my cash out hook your girl up yeah i'm begging all right bye